know that uh, fighters have a pre-fight routine. What do you do when you're going to host something? Uh, do you get the pre pre-fight or the pre-stage uh, jitters or anything? No, just Nick. A lot of uh, you know these cards <laughs> to read off of. There's, there's all the cards here. They have stuff on them. All right. Um, is that it written in English? This is this is actually <laughs> written in Hebrew, oh. but. <laughs> Which I can't read. Uh, well, that's but, all right. But don't, I thought I would write through. it that anyway. No, um, just a matter of going through and preparing and getting ready to do it. And, you know, hosting events are interesting because you have your specific, you know, the format says to do this, 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 and this. Yeah. And you always have that. But there is inevitably something that makes it change yeah. and just the things you're prepared for are not always the things you're going to end up doing. Well, it's a lot like life, but you know. This would, that, that, Ron, that's a very good point. It is much <laughs> like life. Well, listen, I don't want to hold you up. You you get out there and, uh, you know, lead, lead the way. You be the lead dog tonight. Everything will work out fine. I will do the best I can not to embarrass you. Never be ashamed of what you are because I'm not ashamed of what you are. I'm not <laughs> really. You know, I think that's one of the, the nicest compliments I ever got. Well, I, I but, appreciate that. But then I'm that. delusional. So. That's true. Later, you'll get in there and say, what the hell did you say to what me? What did Ron say to me, yeah, actually? Right. Right. Thank you, Al. <laughs> Good to see you.